I'm Mark from uh, Joshua, Texas. Yes, I've been a Republican uh, since about 1990. Republican and a Christian and, and been conservative since then. Haven't voted for a Democrat for president since 1988. I was a liberal back in college, but uh, 1990 is when I came to faith as a Christian and started voting a lot more conservatively and aligning myself with the Christian coalition way back then. You know, I think you can be both. You can be for limited government. Um, you, can, you can be for help, helping the poor, but there are ways to do it that are, uh, you know, compassionate, but still giving them responsibility. So I try to be still be respectful of President Trump. Um, but just the, watching what he did over, over the years, over the last three and a half, four years, um, I've just seen so many things that I think disqualify him as, as a leader. A big part of it is, is just disregarding the rule of law, you know, interfering in um, cases that are being litigated and intimidating witnesses. Um, it's been very troubling to me that he's had lots of good people around him and, and he just won't listen to them. I've, I've never seen anybody, I guess his age, be so willing to disregard expertise. Um, and he's just disregarded that. Um, is a, la a lack of humility that, that really troubles me. That, that has to be there in a president. And I think you can look back, a, a lot of presidents, whether they were Democrat or Republican, they were still relatively humble. I know during when President Clinton got impeached, for all of us, for us Christians, character was important back then. And I, and I thought it was too. I thought he should have resigned. Uh, and he should have been removed from office if he wasn't going to resign. President Trump has done far worse than anything President Clinton did. And, and we're just ignoring it. Right now, it's become really serious. And so, to me, I, I would rather have a Democrat for president than, than have President Trump. I, I just think, I think Joe Biden right now would be a far better president. And we could endure him for four years. And hopefully the Republican Party would get back on track.